We walked into the store and they didn't have what they said on the sign. When she said, Vaccine, these are so easy, we could make them. She meant go home and make a bear in our craft room. There's a place where you can go and you can make your own teddy bear. Welcome to Build-A-Bear. Have you ever been into a store where you can make best friends? And I was like, this is gonna be big. If you build it, they will come. Are we ready? Everybody, wave your bears in the air. Little Build-A-Bear virtually shut down all the malls in the United States. Thousands of people across the country stood in line for hours, all for stuffed animals. How hot is this toy right now? How many, How many times, times have, have we been, been to Build-A-Bear? Build -A -Bear? We have lost count. Yes. Oh. Banks wouldn't lend to us because we were female-led and weren't proven. But all the kids that I asked knew that it was going to be successful. Oh my <laughs> god, this is magical. What brings us in today, guys? To build a bear. You've come to the right place. In a Build-A-Bear shop, you're able to do whatever your heart wants to do. It's your creation. You're building it and not somebody else. How did Build-A-Bear manage to survive all these years? We are in a recession. Scores of retailers went bankrupt. But as for the last time, you can't go to Build-A-Bear. Build-A-Bear was never really just a toy store. It wasn't really about the bear. We became part of family memories. When I got the bear back, it was like getting my mom back again. The bear the will always be with you forever. Build-A-Bear is a way of life for a lot of us. When Mike Tyson wants to keep his teddy bear, he keeps his teddy bear. This is the story of Build-A-Bear Workshop. <gasps> hey, I'm out of popcorn. You want anything? No thanks, I'm stuffed. <laughs>